My name is Catherine and I am an automotive painter. I uh, actually chose to be an automotive painter because um, I guess there's just a lot of chemistry involved, a lot of detail and well, attention to detail. And um, there are days where it can be like, I'm not gonna lie, it's, it can be very stressful, but um, at the end of the day, um, it's, it's still, it still really excites me because I always have something that challenges me every day. And I mean, it's something, it's always different. So we have to do a lot of color matching. Uh, especially with uh, Tesla colors, there's a lot of problems sometimes because they're um, three stages or four stages, which means that there's a lot of different reds that go into it and a lot of different layers of paint and so forth. And uh, you, if you mess up one layer, then you have a problem with the whole color. It can change it like tremendously. There's uh, masking. If you don't mask uh, the car properly, um, you can have a lot of problems, uh, like you might see undertones and so forth. Um, and in general, like you would get overspray on a car and customers don't get too happy about that because there's overspray, you don't want that. <laughs> With also that, there's a lot of, um, I guess, making sure that the body work's done properly because sometimes the body men slack and preppers and painters have to make sure that that's all accounted for, make sure that the preppers do their jobs properly so that when the paint goes on the car, we have no problems afterwards. I know um, a lot of my coworkers uh, went through university and then ended up actually going back into the trades um, because there weren't jobs coming out of university and so forth, and or they just didn't like it. and um, just kind of learned the hard way. But I mean, there's nothing wrong with going into college and doing a trades and being very technical and practical. I, I hope that in the near future, uh, the stigma starts breaking down and people start enjoying the trades more. And um, there's nothing wrong with being hands-on and doing the nitty gritty, I love it.